Always on a lookout for new things in town, and this time around, we've discovered a beautiful floating restaurant in the middle of the sea in Mumbai. So this is the jetty number five, which is right opposite Taj Mahal Palace at Gateway of India, and this is where you need to come to catch the transfer ship for a memorable experience. Mind that guests of all age group would want to visit Queen's Line. A second pontoon is in the making where guests can conveniently get on to the transfer ship for a lovely experience that lies ahead. Well, Queen's Line has about seven to eight transfer ships, and each ship can accommodate about 10 to 12 people, which means when you are here, there's going to be less waiting time. You are illuminating. I don't really care about the people in the bar line. I don't really mind all the who goes doing stage dives. I don't care at all, baby. You got my attention, so you would say yeah. I make your way to Queen's Line via in a speedboat. It's hardly going to take any time, but the Queen's Line staff is going to make sure that you have your life jacket on. See the logic of things. It's quite a lonely world. We've arrived outside the fabulous looking floating restaurant and I have to say that the journey from the jetty to the ship has been fun, comfortable and convenient, definitely worth the boarding charge that you paid for. looks absolutely fantastic this is the lower deck and it pretty much gives a 360 degree view of the sea even if i told you i could never let you go i'm not so sure you believe me but if i mean to show you i will never let you go no well being a floating restaurant one would imagine that the space is perfect for a sundowner or dining scene but trust me i'm here in the day and it's equally fun as long as you have your sunglasses on pleasure, i'm sure everything makes total sense when you're next to me Well, the upper deck on level 1 is open to the sky and literally on the same level if you're looking for an intimate gathering there's a private dining room which can easily accommodate 25 to 30 people. Well, there's also a premium lounge at Queen's Line CR which comes with exclusive services and is ideal for a group of 10 to 12. But well, I'm a big mojito fan and turns out that this place is a treat for me as they have a mojito bar. Well, they also have a gin bar and they serve about 15 varieties of in-house bitters. Well, the ship is big enough and flexible enough to hold any kind of event, be it weddings, corporates or even a private event. Well, the experience of dining in the middle of the sea would be incomplete if you don't indulge in some seafood pizza. Oh, 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 
spectacular in the day, mesmerizing in the evening and magical in the night. I would say that this place is perfect for brunch, lunch or even a romantic dinner.